what's up guys welcome back to another video my name is Callie Green and today's video is going to be a Sunday reset I am currently living in the Air Force dorms and I wanted to show you guys how I spend my Sundays preparing for the week I'm starting my Sunday by doing some laundry and washing my bed sheets which I do once a week it can be frustrating because our washers are very tiny but I make it work while my laundry is going I will be deep cleaning my room I do live with a sweet mate, but thankfully I got very lucky and my sweet mate is super clean and hygienic like me, so our bathroom never gets dirty because we each clean it at least once a week. After cleaning my bathroom, I'm going to be restocking. Unfortunately, I am on my period right now, so I'm going to have to restock my products. After this, I'm going to restock the toilet paper. Me and my sweet mate take turns buying toilet paper and it was my turn. Now I'm going to remove everything from my counter, wipe down under there, and then put everything back. I will then be reorganizing my hair drawer. Sometimes in the morning I get ready super quick so it gets kind of messy after a month or so. So once a month I just clean it out, wipe it out, and then just reorganize and restock. I am then going to clean my mirrors. I do this at least once a week, especially because I have cabinet mirrors. They get super dirty super quick from opening and closing the cabinet. Next, I'm going to be dusting my fan and my vents. I only do this about once a month, maybe once every two months because it doesn't get super dusty here. After my clothes are done in the washer, I'm just going to throw them in the dryer and then swap it out with my bed sheets. Next up, I'm going to be resetting my calendar since it is finally May. It's almost summer, y'all. I am resetting my calendar in my whiteboard. When I was resetting my calendar, I was listening to music and this song literally said my name. I was just in disbelief. Obviously it wasn't talking about me, but it's like still my name. And I was like, that's so hard. I'm about to use that for every single one of my Instagram stories. Unfortunately, my periods are really rough. Yesterday I was literally in bed all day. I could not move. And today I was being productive, but sadly for like an hour, I just could not move. The cramps and back pain were insane. So that was rough. But like they say, a period don't stop nothing but a sentence and nothing is going to stop me from finishing my Sunday routine. Now I'm just folding my laundry. I have to fold my laundry while it's still hot. And yes, I still roll my socks BMT style. Don't judge. It's my favorite way to roll my socks. It's so cute. Don't judge. Now I'm just going to be vacuuming my carpet and topping that off with a little bit of fabric spray. It is now 6 p.m. The defect has opened, so I'm going to go on a hot girl walk to get some dinner. Tonight I ate pasta, chicken, greens, okra, an uncrustable, two kiwis, and an orange. Now I'm just going to be making my bed. This is absolutely my favorite part. Not because I like making my bed, but because I love crawling into fresh bed sheets after a shower on a Sunday. There's literally no better feeling in the world. Now it is shower time and it's Sunday, which means long shower day. If you struggle with dry scalp, this shampoo will absolutely change your life. Just trust me, it is the best shampoo. You will never have a dry scalp or itchy scalp again. First, I shampoo with the Nozoro Life Changer, and then I'm just going to be using my Native Shampoo and Native Conditioner. I always wash my hair with cold water and let the conditioner sit with a claw clip. Next, I'll use my Tree Hut Exfoliant, and then I will shave with conditioner right after. I'm going to turn the water back down to cold and then wash my conditioner out before I wash my body. Always wash your conditioner out first because conditioner can clog up your pores. Next up, I'll be using the Method Body Wash, and then I'll be using the Honey Pot Feminine Wash. In my opinion, this is the best and most healthy feminine wash there is. After I get out of the shower, I'll be washing my face. This Clinique face wash will melt your makeup off of your skin. It is so much better than makeup wipes and so much less abrasive. I could not recommend a product more. Next, I'll use my La Roche-Posay cleanser and then I'll be brushing my teeth with my Quip toothbrush and my Crest 3D White toothpaste. 
I will then be putting on a face mask. I absolutely love everything Hydro Boost by Neutrogena. And then I will be letting that sit while I meditate for 20 minutes. This is absolutely my favorite meditation by Lavender, and I'll make sure to link it below. And then I will remove my face mask and moisturize with my Hydro Boost cream. Lastly, I'll be braiding my hair and putting it in a bonnet. It doesn't matter what color your skin is, bonnets are for everybody with hair. Wearing a bonnet while you sleep is key to healthy hair. The cramps never went away, so before bed, I am going to be icing my stomach. It might seem a little weird, but surprisingly, ice helps me sometimes more than heat. Finally, I'm going to turn on one of my comfort movies and I'm going to go to sleep. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to another video. I love you guys so much and I hope you love this video as much as I do. I'll see you guys in the next one and don't forget to subscribe and like. I love you.